Hello, my name is Kim Sauer for EMS Now here at Productronica 2013. I'm joined today by Stefan Techau from DEC. Stefan, thank you very much for joining us here in um, beautiful and uh, very cold Munich. Um, now, I've been past your, sh your stand right. uh, a couple of times and it's very difficult maneuvering past the multitude of people that are um, being looked after on your stand. So there is something there that is attracting everybody. Tell us what it is. Reveal your secrets. Hey Kim, uh, thank you for having me here, giving me a chance to uh, give you an update of what, what's happening here with DEC. Productronica is remaining one of the lead shows for us that uh, certainly is very important for Europe, but also reaches out to other regions. We had customers here from Mexico, uh, we have customers from, uh, from Asia as well, and mm -hmm. from the US. Uh, we have more customers here from the UK um, and the usual mix from all the European countries. Um, it's interesting that you, that you have noticed it. I would have been surprised if you wouldn't have asked because, <laughs> because it, it, it's, it is tremendously busy and I'm, I'm really happy how good it's going this year. It's, mm -hmm. it's certainly uh, a better quality of, of interesting discussions that we have compared to probably two years ago. So we see the industry getting a bit more uh, ready for investment. Mm -hmm. So, what do you think those reasons are? I mean, what's the difference between two years ago and now? Yeah, what we what we see, obviously, since we had the the downturn in two thousand nine, people have slowly coming back into investment mode, but projects have been moved around. Mm -hmm. So last year was a strong year for us. This year is going to be good for us as well, and next year we are going to build onto that because we have customers that needs to be getting ready for more miniaturization in the industry that's happening. There's more demand from the customers of our customers for quality and throughput. And obviously that's a very competitive industry. Mm -hmm. So our customers get pushed year on year, like how can you help us delivering more products you know, for, for um, better cost price performance. Sure. And that's where we are committed to help our customers. And is there a different approach, do you think? Because, uh, you know, customers that used to come maybe with their checkbooks or whatever it was, is there a different approach now? Are they more cautious? Uh, do they want more information? Is there more emphasis on, on the machine side or the service side? Or, uh, what's your feeling? Um, well, first of all, I need to highlight that we actually had some handshakes throughout the last two days. Yep. So we actually did some sales. So that hasn't changed. Mm -hmm. It's still in, uh, nice to see on this trade show here, people are, are decision makers are coming, yeah. they want to understand what is the industry able to offer us and then uh, people if they learn what DEC has to offer and the added value that we can give, they, they just can't, they just can't, you know, they can't go away anymore. <laughs> so certainly products that we are um, showing uh, and unveiling to the industry are all biased to give customers more quality, more throughput and lower their cost of operation, and cost mm -hmm. of ownership. Mm -hmm. And with that, um, here we are looking at uh, products like a new combination of paste roll height monitor with paste dispenser. That gives them uh, less operator intervention and more time for the operator to do value add work. Uh, it gives them better throughput and quality. We have the new vector guard high tension frame that gives customers a longer lifetime of the stencil mm -hmm. and a better uh, aperture fill and a better process. Mm -hmm. And um, also we have closed loop in the next version, next generation, Pro Deck is the, the product name, mm -hmm. uh, which is um, an intelli intelligent software engine that takes real statistic data from the SPI, that's downline of the printer. It then makes decision on can I optimize alignment to get more quality and yield, and can I optimize clean weight Mm. Again, to get more throughput, mm. to get the cost down. So those are the highlights we are sharing with customers. So really what I'm hearing you saying is a, 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 a key emphasis on customer needs and wants and, and, and problems they might be facing and you offering them the solutions that they really need and ticking all those boxes. Yeah, sure. It's, it's, again, the industry challenge is miniaturization mm. and customers need useful um, tools to help them mm. to overcome that. Um, miniaturization alone is something that they need to keep in mind but also again you have small components with small apertures and you have big components 
on the same PCB or substrate, these heterogeneous assemblies we call them, those are the challenges we see on the roadmap for the industry and yeah. they will come, some of these challenges will come quite quickly mm -hmm. and for those we have all the tools available, yeah. including the service and the know-how. And there's also, along with all that development and the work you've been doing, there's uh, some, some reasons to celebrate as well because it's not just you saying, hey guys, look how what we have and these are the benefits, but I believe you've also been awarded for some of these solutions that you're offering. Tell us what award you received. Okay, uh, yesterday there was the award um, ceremony of the uh, Productivity, the, the Global Electronic Award, mm -hmm. which we got for the category printing, mm -hmm. uh, which was quite competitive this year, to my understanding, because it's a competitive market and also this award, um, or the, the products handed in have been competitive, mm -hmm. and we won that award for our closed loop Prodex system. Again, that because it gives uh, customers true value in terms of quality and throughput. Mm -hmm. Well done, congratulations. Thank you. So what do awards like that mean to you as a company? First of all, it's an encouragement for the team. I mean, the team puts a lot of effort into it. Our people make those things happen. And if we get those awards, um, it, it just, it, it just, it's great for the team. It's a good motivator, good mm -hmm. feedback from, from a jury that values our added value. Mm -hmm. And um, it's a good recognition within the industry that we are continuously delivering uh, leading products into mm -hmm. the market. Well, well done again. Congratulations. Thank and, you. And um, good luck with the rest of the show. Uh, and thank you very much for taking the time out of your busy schedule at the booth to talk to us today. Thank you. Kim. Thank you very much.